no villainizing any mental illnesses. It's not nice. Good morning, Internet friends. How are we doing today? I'm doing all right. Um, just got out of class. Class was kind of stressful. Um, turns out for our test, we now have a take-home test. Exciting. And then someone left a note in my car saying that I parked like a bad word. So now I'm at the post office. I'm about to mail off Little Bit's vest because I'm going to be trading with somebody on Instagram for a bigger vest and they're supposed to be sending theirs off today also so yay and I'm pretty excited about getting a new vest and he may be getting a second one from someone who's just like here just have this vest and both of the vests are going to fit him until he's full grown so I'm so happy so yeah now I'm about to go inside and deal with getting his vest mailed off and I'll check back in with you guys later hey guys there's my whammy boys hey reindeer hi Amarel what are you doing MRL, can you do pressure? Hey, MRL, pressure, pressure all the way. Ah, that's up. Thanks. You use me as a step stool, little butthole. So, the last time I picked up the camera was like around noon. It is like 8:41 now. Good job, Raven. Best vlogger ever. Just kidding. Let me move this. Meds that somebody cannot steal from mommy. Rotten child. Why are you licking me? So what has the day been? Little Bit's vest is on its way to Texas. And he'll be getting a new one in. And then he's getting another vest from New Jersey. So yay! So excited. So thank you, Caitlin and Maddie, for sending him his new vests. I mean, they're not brand new, they're used, but they're new for us. And I'm good with that. And he'll be able to grow into them, so you'll have choices. I'll show you what they look like whenever I get them. Yes, I have seen pictures, and I know what they look like. They're very, very cute. Ow! Stop standing on my feet. Stop. Thank you. Um... Watched YouTube. I watched the movie Sybil, which I've seen before and I really like it. If you've never seen it, you need to watch it. It's an old movie. I think it's from the 70s? I don't remember. But it's about a girl with multiple personality disorder. And it's actually based off a real person. And it was right when they, when people actually knew that multiple personality disorder or now known as dissociative identity disorder, people didn't know that existed. And that movie helped to kind of bring it more mainstream, I guess. Which, I mean, now people have villainized multiple personality disorders. Which is not cool. Not cool at all, guys. MRL doesn't think it's cool either. Do you, boy? Okay, no, vi no villainizing any mental illnesses. It's not nice. No. Um. And then I dropped Tyler off at the O guy. He, Todd, and Jonah went to see the Lego Batman movie. I hung out with Laura and Allison, and I played Play-Doh with her, which was a lot of fun. And I actually didn't have any intention of staying, but I ended up staying for about an hour, and it was wonderful. I was trying to, like, make plans with Lakota, but she was in school still, so... Another day. <sighs> but now, I just took the dogs out. Sassy's probably still outside. And I need to go take a shower. Hello. Hi, baby. Come. MRL, can you do pressure? Come here. No, that's paw. Though you're getting very good at paw. He will paw anything. You're licking my foot. That is not a task of yours to lick me. I still love you, though. MRL. Focus. Yes. Pressure. Do I have pressure? Look. Pressure. MRL, come here. Pressure. 
No. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, buddy. I know. It's more distracting now because Big Brother's back. Arr, Big Brother Shark. So now I'm going to go and get me a shower and I'm going to check back in with you guys later. Hey, guys. Again, shiny face because I have lotion on my face. Yay. There be the red lor. He's so cute when he's sleeping. There be the emerald. And there be the sassy. So, let's see. What all has happened? Got a shower. That's always fun. Um, I think before the shower I did a live stream with Emerald and Riddler, which was always exciting. I like live streaming my animals. <laughs> um, and I didn't get the usual questions this time. Usually the usual questions are like, what breed is... He is Emerald, not Riddler. Riddler is pretty obvious what he is. Emerald's not as obvious. Um, and like how long hairs exist in wimes, so there's that. Um, I did participate in a friend of mine's live stream, which was really fun. I was happy to see him. I haven't really heard from him in a while. But I learned that a con that I've been promising people I'd go to is in two weeks. I can't make it to that con at all. And it's down in Tallahassee. So I'm just like, no! Yeah, free cons in Tallahassee. Which is like seven hours away. I don't think I could go to a con that's seven hours away in two weeks. No. I will be going to Con Nuga this weekend, though, so. Yay! I need to finish Yuri's Ice Skates. And I think I have Zookeeper Asahi figured out. Um, I'm just gonna get... If I can't find a collared shirt that fit me, I'll just wear, like, my old Camp Counselor shirt. Then probably carry around this stuffed snow leopard that I have. Which, actually, I have a story behind this snow leopard that I thought I would share with you guys. Let me grab him. This is my little snow leopard. His name is Tiger. Why is he called Tiger? Well, I think it was last summer... Or this past summer. I don't remember which. Um, I went with my parents, Tyler, my half-brother James, and his fiance. We all went to the zoo that I now work at. And when we left, James bought me this little guy. Because um, he usually gets my brother things, but really doesn't buy me anything much. So this was an opportunity where he knew that I liked animals. And he thought this was a tiger. Even though it's not. Tigers have stripes, kids. So I named this snow leopard Tiger. And it will probably be one of my props for Kanuga. It is so soft. Um, but yeah. Other than that, guess what? I didn't get the vlog up. Yay. Um, I just got to feel I was feeling very fatigued kind of feeling lazy and then mentally I started feeling weird like a little bit anxious a lot of bit of what is this I don't know I don't know what's going on with my brain my brain's weird so now I'm going to sign off for the night and head off to bed so thank you guys so much for watching I hope you've had a wonderful day or night rain or shine whatever the world has for you today um question of the day is if you have a stuffed animal, and it's named, because I know some people don't name stuffed animals, what is the special reason behind its name? As you guys know, I already told you Tiger's name and his reasoning behind it, and I'll tell you one more. I have this big floppy stuffed horse named Caspian. And the reason he's named Caspian is because he was given to me by my boyfriend when I was in 8th grade. He's not my boyfriend anymore. And we were going to go see um, the Chronicles of Narnia Prince Caspian. And oh my gosh, the, whoever played Caspian, such a beautiful man. <laughs> I named the horse Caspian, so there you go. So if you have a stuffed animal that has a special name, let me know what, what it is and why it's named that way. Because that's just fun stuff, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye! Good night, Wyme 1. Good night, Wyme 2. 
Good night, number one, Pepperdoodle.